The healthy brain is a massive biocomputer running on a combination of electrical and chemical or neurotransmitter exchanges. The brain relies on its neuronal network. So we need to understand firstly what exactly is a neuron. It is the fundamental unit of the brain and the nervous system. It is in fact its infrastructure and for critical in allowing us to process sensory input from our world and react to that. Neurons allow us to function, to be alive. The synapse is the gap or space between neurons as they don't actually touch, which is why they need the neurotransmitters to carry the messages across. This is intensely demanding of energy, which is provided by the mitochondria. These are the powerhouses of all cells and they create energy rich molecules, ATP, for the cells by breaking down glucose. And synapses are loaded with mitochondria. A neuron is composed of a cell body which surrounds the nucleus where the neurotransmitters are produced. However, the neurotransmitters need to be transported long distances to the end of the axon to be used to cross the synapses. This is possible due to the microtubules. They are both the internal infrastructure of the neuron, they are microscopic hollow tubes, and as such, they allow to, them to function as the conveyor belt within the cells. They allow the movement of mitochondria and vesicles. The SNARE acronym is one of those wonderful ones where the word actually reflects its function. The SNARE complex has a crucial role in neurotransmitter function and does in fact catch and release them. It controls the docking, the priming, the fusion and the synchronized neurotransmitter release into the synaptic cleft.